audio engineering and music production course at SACAC has been designed keeping in mind the need of the modern day producer. In today's day and age, I don't think it's possible to have the luxury of working independently only on a specific skill set. You have to be equipped with almost everything that goes into the signal chain or the food chain of production from recording your material to maybe mixing your material to arranging your material to producing your own material. And keeping that in mind, the course has been designed to give you a specific skill set in each department, but look at the entire picture, the long term picture. Along with the engineering and production aspect of the course, there are also elements taken care of by Chayan Adhikari and Ujwal Nagar. They deal with uh, understanding the system of music, uh, appreciating the theory and the fundamentals of uh, Western music and of the Indian system also, which I think are extremely important. The campus also houses two uh, state-of-the-art studios which meet industry specifications. And apart from that, there is an ever-growing list of equipment which the students have full access to. And uh, also a practice lab where they get ad additional time to work on their skill set apart from the main studios. There are a lot of institutes which offer similar courses, but I think what separates us and also what our key focus is that we are focused on the art of production, keeping the science in mind, of course. It, it's a highly technical job, but at the end of the day, it's about creation of art. I teach uh, a course called uh, Fundamentals of Music. Having a creative approach to music uh, is a very important skill, and that's what we try and do at uh, the Fundamentals of uh, Music uh, module uh, under a part of the audio and music production course. And uh, students come from varying backgrounds. The idea is to bring them up to speed uh, bring them on the same page uh, regarding the skills and basic fundamentals required uh, to be able to create music on their own and even appreciate and understand nuances uh, of music a bit better. Uh, it involves breaking down existing songs, learning about chords and progressions, uh, melodic and rhythmic concepts and music appreciation forms a massive part of the course. Uh, we try and jam in bands, uh, create music together, write for uh, ensembles and even uh, experiment with real life scenarios uh, such as creating jingles or musical backgrounds uh, with real life deadlines and scenarios. I think it's become imperative for uh, professionals to have a versatile uh, skill set, uh, especially when you think of music. It's very easy these days. Uh, if you have your basics down, uh, you can really, really exploit some of these tools that are available to you today. Uh, so having a creative approach, which is exactly what uh, this course does, really opens up a lot of avenues in the future. No matter what kind of professional you want to be in the music industry, uh, having a creative approach to music is very, very important. And this is exactly what we try and do uh, as a part of this course because it can really help you explore a lot of avenues in the future. The sessions that I teach at SACAC are designed in a manner to enable the students to appreciate Hindustani classical music. Although I feel that study of Hindustani classical music is a lifelong process, but the sessions which the students will be attending and I'll, I'll be teaching will uh, have topics which will in a manner touch every aspect of Hindustani classical music and the performance aspect of it. In this global age with increasing number of producers entering the music field, it's very important for anyone to have their own sound and have a better understanding of various styles of music, be it Western or Indian. And these sessions will be focusing on uh, giving you a better understanding and uh, uh, providing a new outlook to appreciate Hindustani classical music by simplifying various elements of Indian music such as raga, tala and compositions it's very important that every person who is entering this field of music or production, uh, apart from the technical education, it's good to have a rich knowledge base of various styles of music. And these sessions will certainly initiate the students to the world of Hindustani classical music.